okay so uh, from the preceding discussion it is clear about what is the meaning of this and what is the meaning so what is the meaning of e of y given x i have told you that i have explained you that and i have also told you that that function e of y given x can be precisely written as beta 1 plus beta 2 into x so this is clear now what i want to tell you is what is meant by linearity what is the meaning of linearity so uh, in econometrics basically you have two types of linearity one is linear in variables and the other is linear in parameters now what i am concerned with later would be called as linear in parameters so uh, later when we talk about whenever we will be talking about all the concepts of multi collinearity of dummy variables of autocorrelation heteroscedasticity homoscedasticity of whatever whatever concept we talk about i will be basically referring to linearity in parameters right and not linearity in variables however what is linearity in variables so linearity in variables is whenever your variable is in linear form so for example if i say uh, e of y given x is equal to beta 1 plus beta 2 x this is linear in variable so x is coming linearly however if i say x square it's non linear if i say x to the power 1 by 2 it's non linear if I say x to the power 1 by 3, it's non-linear. If I say x to the power e, it's non-linear. If I say e to the power x, it's again non-linear. So, all these are non-linear functions. If I say 1 upon x, which is nothing but x to the power minus 1, it's non-linear. If I say beta 2 uh, instead of x, if I have log x, it's again non-linear. Right? So, it's non. all these examples were non-linear in variables now let's talk about linearity in terms of parameters so in terms of parameters you just have two parameters beta 1 and beta 2 if these two are coming linearly then it's linear in parameter otherwise it's non-linear in parameter so for example e expectation of y given x is equal to beta 1 plus beta 2 x i square here beta 1 and beta 2 are appearing linearly so it's linear in parameter but it's non-linear in variables if i say e of y given x is equal to beta 1 plus 1 by beta 2 x this is linear in variable but non-linear in parameter is this clear okay let's go further then let's take an example so this is quadratic function it's non-linear in variable linear in parameter this is linear in parameter or non-linear in parameter so let's take an example for this so this is clearly non-linear in variable now sometimes it might not be very clear whether a thing is linear or non-linear in variables and parameters or whether it can be converted to some easier form and the thing can be easily seen so what do i do in such cases is convert so exponential function if it is y is equal to e to the power beta 1 plus beta 2 x i take log on both sides so it becomes ln y is equal to beta 1 plus beta 2 x ln e so this goes off ln e goes off this is 1 so you have ln y is equal to beta 1 plus beta 2 x so this is linear in parameter but non-linear in a variable y is also a variable and log is coming so it's non-linear in variable right so sometimes i can convert something from non-linear to linear or i can by conversion see whether a model is linear in parameter or variable or whether it is not so now let's talk about something see for us something if it is linear in parameter then for me it is linear because i am only concerned with parameter if something is linear in variable but not linear in parameter then for me it is not linear because i will consider something to be